One problem for new VRChat creators has always been where to start. Fortunately, VRChat had what was essentially a silent release of their new Creator Companion app. The open beta for it originally started back in May, which is also when the breakdown was posted on their website. Of course, now that it will be the main way of making VRChat projects, I think it's time to give it a quick rundown. If you're already familiar with the content creation for VRChat, you may recognize that it shares a lot of ideas with Unity Hub, such as project creation. However, its primary purpose is to provide a clean way of up updating your project whenever new releases come out, as well as condensing the getting started steps down to what is essentially one program. You see, the Creator Companion, or VCC, or VRCCC if you're a monster, will automatically install both Unity Hub and the current Unity version, if you don't have them already. This tool also comes with VRChat's new SDK system, and while you can make new projects with it just fine, old projects will have to be adapted over to it. Fortunately, unlike the literally unsupported conversion from SDK 2.0, Two to three, this conversion is handled directly by the VCC and is in all respects just a reformatted version of SDK3. Of course, given the infinite complexity of game development, this conversion may have some hiccups from time to time. So, unless you already use some form of version control like GitHub or Plastic, I recommend clicking Migrate a Copy instead of Migrate in Place, just to be sure nothing goes horribly wrong during the process and you've totally destroyed your whole project. So outside of just being a new package system for their SDK, you can also import custom VRChat packages through the system and keep them up to date. Note these are not Unity package files, but instead similar to packages you would import from the Unity package manager itself, just with more VRChat centric features. They're already using the system for add-ons like Client Sim, which is their way of testing your worlds inside of Unity and basically just a really big fancy update to sign in. The VCC also marks the first public releases of Udon Sharp 1.0, which is now developed internally alongside Udon itself, which Merlin is still very much at the helm of. The app also comes with a smaller program called the VRC Quick Launcher, which is essentially a tool for booting up VRChat with very specific settings, multiple versions, and even testing already built versions of local worlds. This is one of those things where, if it's for you, you'll probably know. If you have any questions or problems with the program, the team has been generally pretty responsive in the Creator Companion channel of the VRChat Discord, and you can download it on the same page as you normally get the SDKs on already. If you like this format, feel free to let me know, as it's much faster to write for and not everything can really justify a full 10-20 to 20 minute video. Of course, special thanks to all my patrons, have a good day, and we'll see you next time.